many different things can cause early or premature menopause. And indeed, early or premature menopause is only the last ultimate step of early ovarian aging or premature ovarian aging, as we have come to call it. Uh, therefore, one does not necessarily have to wait until this end stage of menopause, true menopause is reached. The vast majority of women who have this problem in association with infertility are fortunately enough in premature aging stages. And it is very important to differentiate between those two conditions because while still prematurely aging but not yet in early menopause, we still can help most women. Once in menopause, it becomes very difficult. Many of our colleagues believe that diminished ovarian reserve is untreatable. Uh, our center really does not believe that and hasn't believed in that for a good number of years, uh, principally based uh, on our experience with DHEA. Our center was instrumental in bringing uh, DHEA into the infertility treatment and today based on a recent survey, approximately a third of all IVF centers around the world have started using DHA, and I wouldn't be surprised if by now the number uh, is even bigger. Through our DHA experience, uh, we have come uh, to a new understanding of ovarian aging. Uh, one of the interesting observations that we have made in our DHA-treated patients with very, very severely diminished ovarian reserve is not only that we are getting a surprising number of pregnancies, but once these women get pregnant, our miscarriage rates are surprisingly low. Such low miscarriage rates could not be achieved if indeed the eggs these women were born with aged and declined in quality. Because once an egg is of poor quality, no DHA or no drug that I can think about can reverse that kind of, of a process. It would seem irreversible. And as we recognized that, we started thinking uh, about what could really explain uh, our observation of low miscarriage rates in these DHA-treated patients. And then it came to us that what likely is happening is that the very immature egg, uh, the, the egg in storage, if I may call it that, the egg that has not yet been recruited into maturation, that's the egg a woman is born with. We think that egg at this very immature stage actually does not age, it's suspended in time. What is aging is the ovarian environment in which this egg, once it is recruited into maturation, goes through the maturation process. Because if this environment in an older woman is lacking DHEA, and if DHEA has an important function in this environment, then supplementing DHEA can improve the environment and therefore an initially perfect immature egg allow again a much healthier and better maturation process. <music>